Aging isn't just about candles on a cake, it's about how your cells remember time. Meet the epigenetic clock, one of the most powerful tools we have for measuring biological age. Because unlike your calendar age, which just counts your birthdays, your biological age reflects how fast or slow your body is actually aging. Here's the twist. It's not your DNA that changes over time, your DNA stays the same. What changes is how your genes are expressed, and this is controlled by something called epigenetics. Think of epigenetics as sticky nodes placed on your DNA. These nodes tell your cells which genes to turn on and off. Over time, those nodes pile up in patterns that correlate with aging, and that's exactly what epigenetic clocks read. One of the most famous, the Horvath clock created by Dr. Steve Horvath. It uses patterns of DNA methylation, tiny chemical tags that attach to your DNA to estimate your biological age with surprising accuracy. And why does this matter? Because knowing your biological age is like getting a health report card from your cells. Some people are 50 on paper, but 35 biologically. Others, the reverse. Even better, studies now show it's possible to slow down or even reverse your epigenetic age through lifestyle changes like fasting, sleep, exercise, and certain supplements. So, next time someone asks your age, the real answer might be hiding in your epigenome. Because at Neuravis, we know that the future of longevity isn't about guessing, it's about measuring, optimizing, and evolving.